Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's your girl, Cat Coley. We back. We back with another hypothetically speaking. I don't know. Tell y'all one thing. It's hot. Alright. We're gonna take a little walk. Hypothetically speaking, we're gonna go over the topic. Mm -mm. Ain't no way in hell. Let's do that. What would that mean? Per se, ain't no way in hell. Y'all know people be like, man, ain't no way in hell. It ain't no way in hell you done came up like that. It ain't no way in hell you done turned around and did that. It ain't no way in hell you could talk to me like that. You feel me? Ain't no way in hell. Hmm. Let's talk about it. Let's just say, like, all right, so first we have to talk about where is hell? Because if we say ain't no way in hell, is hell here right where we're at? But then we'll have to think about where is right where we're at? Is it like right here on earth? Or is it like right here in our mind? Because everybody have their own hold on. Okay. Everybody have their own mind movie per se you know so we say ain't no way in hell maybe we're talking about living in hell are we living in hell and if we're living in hell, is it a way that we can live in heaven? So we're living in hell on earth. So then we would have to create heaven on earth. Just like the prayer, right? So I'm not off. I'm not crazy. So then if you think of hell, how did hell start? Well, you can probably look at history. We're not going to go over no whole history, you know, run down, you know, because there's bits and pieces that we don't know and da, 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 da. we're not doing that. We're just going to talk about the fact that we're here now and that being here now could possibly be, could possibly be be hell for us you know but if we are creators creating our own mind movies and you create mind movies don't act like you don't you create them movies uh let's say you talk oh uh, you talking about so and so Oh, so-and-so just love me, or so-and-so just whatever, whatever, whatever. Or so-and-so hate me. They they looking at me crazy. They must don't like me. You know what I'm saying? Mind movies. So don't, don't do that. Come on now. They stay cool. <laughs> but if we think about everything that's in hell, I like how I said that if we think about everything that's in hell, mind movie, if we stop thinking about everything that's in hell, 
and think about things that are in heaven, then ultimately we change our living in hell to living in heaven. And so if, ooh, and so if there's no way in hell, because that's the saying, there's no way in hell, regardless on what we put after it, there's no way. So if we think about things that are, let me get up a little bit. Let me get up, uh, process. my shirt by the way ooh, ooh. get serious about having fun all right <laughs> do it look like i'm in hell right now you feel me regardless on if it looks like i'm in hell Because looks can be deceiving. I could be feeling like I'm in hell one moment, and then I could be feeling like I'm in heaven the next moment. But you know, that's what it's all about when it comes down to creating that balance between being in hell and being in heaven. But I think when you get that balance is when you get that momentum of being in heaven. And from, from realizing all of the things that's in, in hell and realizing all of the things that's in heaven, then I could take all of the things, the feelings, the negativeness that's in hell and i can make that conscious decision conscious conscious decision deciding to have those feelings and thoughts and positivity that's in heaven create that momentum to lean more towards over here. So that's why I create my heaven from being in hell. Because if there's no way in hell, I bet you there's a lot of way in heaven. Gotta be. That's just what I'm thinking. That's just how I'm purposefully living. Hypothetically speaking. Hypothetically. Of course. Comment below. Love y'all.